Welcome back to another episode of the Luxury Home Show. Today, you're joining us in Leicestershire and we're going to show you exactly how far your money goes here in the Midlands. It's a five bedroom home and we're going to be doing a full tour today and it's just decided to snow on us. I thought summer was just around the corner, but I think she's with Matt in London today. So let's <laughs> head on inside and kick this tour off. Inside. Snow. Yeah, we have the powder room just here. We'll stick a floor plan up so you can get your bearings. Then come through these double doors into a beautifully open kitchen. Now this central island is pretty big, right? Wow. Very clean design. We've got the Neff induction hob on top with the extractor fan as well. I like the textured wallpaper. It's a nice yeah. difference to paints. And then I'll just move this out of the way so you can see it a little bit better. I like that you've got the double doors into this space. Yes, exactly. We've got the American style fridge freezer in the middle, a variety of Zanussi appliances. So we've got an oven both sides, coffee machine as well as the microwave oven. And I like these almost service style hidden away cupboards. Beautiful stone worktops all the way down. We've got the drainage like set into yeah. it. Got the boiling hot tap, I think, no? Yeah, yes, we yeah. have a boiling tap there. And yeah, very well organised spice rack. Yeah, I like how the induction hob is in the middle with the extractor fan above it. Yeah. And then we have a really characterful exposed beam through here where we've got a seating area and a nice double aspect window. So loads of light comes in yeah. and you can access the terrace out there. I love that, that log burner in the corner. That's incredible. Beautiful, isn't it? And then a really high sort of vaulted ceiling when you come through here, just opens yeah. up. Dining area here, but we also do have a dining area separately through that way. Let me take you through to the utility room. So, Separate access point to the house. I can imagine that's great for walking dogs, things like oh, that. Yeah. You can come in, keep it nice and tidy. And it also keeps those washing machines hidden. Come through here, this is one of my favorite rooms. So this is like a media room, games room. I can imagine this would be where I come to watch the football, the F1, yeah. anything like that, some sports. Yeah, it'd be a great room for that. We've also got a drum kit here too. Ooh, nice. That was fun. Yeah, <laughs> and we've got a pool table too. A little view out to your... Um, yes, yeah, we have access through to the garage just over there. Two car garage and then there's access for about five vehicles out the front. Yeah. Plenty of parking. Oh, Tom spotted the there as well. <laughs> Let's come on through. So obviously we have the stairs here. Going underneath them. Dining area here with a lovely chandelier. Access out to that terrace yet again. Yeah, plenty of drinks. I like the pops of <laughs> colour throughout here. Yeah, I do. And then we have the office through here. So a great home office, get some work done. But let's come through into the sitting room now. Really like the colors in here. It's much more of a mood, do you know what I mean? It's yeah, quite dim. Dark. I can imagine that being great in the evenings for some film, stuff like that. And these two thrones oh. are pretty incredible, aren't they? I know, I just love the fireplace. I love how you've got yeah. all the ambient lighting. I was gonna say, the lighting makes all the difference, especially when you have this exposed brick. It really creates some nice shadows Definitely. and another log burner. So it's great to see that throughout yeah. the house. Yeah. And then again, access out. So we can head out to that terrace. You know, in the summer, sort of between the inside and the outside, it's very seamless. Yeah. Now, really bright in here, great sitting room. I can imagine this would be a great spot to enjoy a cup of coffee, read a book. Yeah. We've got the Velux windows up top. I believe they're Velux, but yeah, bringing loads of light in. Spotlights too. Yeah, it's a great room. Very tranquil. Speaking of which, we're going to head through here. And we have basically a garden room through here. So it steps down. I love how it's sunken. And then we've got another log burner here. And I really like that they've continued that theme with the yeah. dark, the black log burners. You can see the chimney sticking out the top. Loads of natural light coming in through here. So you can really appreciate the garden. Yeah, I like how this is all attached to the house as well. You don't have to go outside to get sure. in here. It's not like an annex, it actually yeah. flows through really nicely. But you can separate it off so it acts yes. like an annex. And just like the landscaping of the garden, it sort of gradually steps down. I think this, yeah, there we go. <laughs> gradually keeps stepping down. And then we have the gym through here. And I mean, what a great gym. You can access your garden out there. So during the summer, I don't know why I was caressing this then, like I was hugging <laughs> it, sorry. Uh, yeah, you can access the garden really easily, which would be nice in the summer, opening them all out, keeping it nice and ventilated Definitely. during those hot and steamy workouts. Right, through here, we actually have access to the pool, so we're going to head through there now and check that out. You ready? Let's go. Now I said 
said out the front when we first started this video how much further your money can go in the Midlands compared to places like London. Now this property is worth 1.175 million pounds, so just over a million, and you have a pool here. Can you imagine how much this would cost in London? So it's an indoor heated pool, really characterful with the exposed beams hanging down. We've got lighting, speakers in the ceiling, bifold doors all along this edge as well, so loads of natural light coming in. Jess, shall we pop out and have a look back at the property? Yeah, let's go. I can't open the door, guys. Two hours later. Can you help with your door? Thanks. Come on out. So we have a massive amount of landscaped gardens, really nicely done, loads of lawn space, high trees, mature trees all around the edge. And then if we look back to the property here, look at all the great terrace space we've got at the back. Beautiful. Right, should we go check out the bedrooms, Jazz? Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Okay, so coming up on to this floor, we switch to carpet. We've got a nice landing here, quite spacious, but first I want to take you in to the principal suite. So we follow this huge hallway it's got loads of storage alongside it too. What a great place to do your makeup. I know, I was just thinking that. Yeah. I could have done with that this morning. Good natural and, lighting. Yeah, exactly. And you've got it all rushing in, the vaulted ceiling as well, double windows to so bring in, like I said, loads of light in. And walk-in wardrobe. Nice. Which is quite a handy size walk-in wardrobe to have, I think. It's kind of tucked away so nicely. Yeah. And then, it's got the bed in the middle. You've got speakers either side of the bed as well. Handy. And then through here, we have our ensuite. Now this is such a generous ensuite. It's huge. You've got the bath in this corner with the shower as well. Twin sinks with the really cool, oh, some really cool mirrors. And you've got those ceramic kind of tiles around as well. But come on, follow me, Tom. I'm gonna close this door. And I'm gonna go into this next one. What wow. a bathroom this is stunning it's like a spa in there it is i like how the dark theme is carried on from that living room downstairs you've got the textured feature walls behind the freestanding bath and in the walk-in shower you've got twin basins once again and these lights i love them you've got spotlights and these hanging ones create that nice ambience throughout here i like the nice pops of yellow too from the towels yeah. the furniture it's really nice yeah and funky mirrors again Oh, you got to look. My favourite. <laughs> there we go. Okay, backing on out, we've got this room right next to it. Currently being set up as a lounge slash study area, but so bright in here. Check out the snow. It looks like a yeah, storm. Yeah, it really is snowing now. Oh my gosh. <laughs> down the corridor. <laughs> What's that walk? My down the corridor <laughs> walk. Go into this one first. Yeah, sure. So we've got another bedroom in here. Great size, and you've got a view out to the front driveway, yeah. and once again, that's snow. But at the end here, this, I think this is my favorite bedroom. Like the principal suite's good, but I like this one because it spans the whole kind of width of the house at this side. You've sure. got dual aspect. So bed in the corner, you've got loads of storage as well. Great mirror on this side. Like on the dressing table, don't you think? Yeah. Like that's, oh yeah. That's powerful, that's just showing every floor on my face, actually. <laughs> <laughs> no yeah. floors on your face. Mm -hmm. Come through into our ensuite, which is actually Jack and Jill. So another great size ensuite. You've got the bath with the shower, window out to the back, so you know no one's looking in over you. Sink here, but then. Ah, so then it's the, uh -huh. the next bedroom. Yeah. So this is the bedroom that's opposite the stairs. Same theme, we've also got another one of those doors leading into a great wardrobe space. I love how deep all the windowsills here as well. So great for your little decorations, I suppose. And yeah. Again. Check, Check out the, out the yeah. snow. <laughs> The property today has been in a great location. We're only 15 minutes away from Rugby. The trains there can get you to London in literally under an hour. Now you're joining us in Foss Park because we're also 15 minutes away from Leicester. So great location. We're going to go get some food. Hope you guys have enjoyed the video. If you like today's tour, I'll stick another one up that is very similar. So if you like that one, you'll like that one too. So make sure you check that out. Subscribe and we'll see you in the next video.